A tense moment in Clintonville over the weekend where a group gathered in the street for illegal street racing. And police say as they went to break it up, they were met with gunfire. NBC4's Eric Halperin has been in the neighborhood talking to people about this and really getting a look at what happened. Eric? Jen and Jared, I've been talking to some area businesses, some neighbors, all who have been here for several years, and they say what happened on Saturday night was a first. A car doing donuts in the middle of Indianola Avenue and East Cook Road as a person hangs out the window. It was Saturday night around 11. There were at least two cars. Uh, they'd kind of take turns. I'd say it went on for the entire thing. It was probably 30 minutes, I'm guessing. Surveillance video from a business also caught some of what was going on. You can hear more tires screeching and see cars and people around the intersection. According to Columbus police, there were about 100 cars there and some people standing in the middle of the road. Police say at some point after they arrived to break things up, shots were fired toward them. Once, once I heard the gunshots and everybody took off running, I, I took off as well, so I didn't stick around to see what was happening at that point. This area resident had first gone outside to see what was going on after hearing the cars and people talking. He says the gunfire took the situation to another level. To be honest with you, kids are going to be kids. I didn't think it was, I mean, yeah, it was a public nuisance blocking the roads. That wasn't cool, but I mean, I didn't think it was a horrible thing until really the gunshots started, and I think that turned it into a very scary situation for a lot of people. And police say they have not made any arrests yet. If you have any information, you're asked to call them. Police declined today's interview request, but told me they're working on a plan to handle these types of incidents. Local for you in Columbus, I'm Eric Halpern, NBC4.